So what's the difference between the Discord app and the Discord bot app in Pipedream? Well, they both do similar things. They can listen to incoming events on your Discord guild, such as listening for messages or new channels created or new members being added. They can both also perform actions like sending a message or kicking a member from the guild or inviting a member. However, the big difference is that when you're sending events or performing actions with the Discord app, it will happen on behalf of the official Pipedream bot. On the flip side, when you've authenticated your own bot with Pipedream and you use the Discord bot to perform an action, you'll be able to use your own custom name and avatar that are, that are sending these messages or performing the actions. The setup between a Discord bot and a Discord app are very different as well. And we'll be making a separate video to show you how to authenticate a Pipedream Discord bot versus a Pipedream authenticated Discord app. But in general, if you're only using Pipedream for one guild and it's in your own internal team, I recommend using the Discord app in Pipedream because authentication is just a couple clicks. You don't have to worry about creating a bot and generating a special URL. But if you're intending to share this bot with other guilds or you wanna have a special custom name, then the bot route is worth the effort and opens up these doors rather than using just the official Pipedream bot. I recommend you start learning with the Discord app and then transitioning over to the Discord bot if you wanna customize it further. The instructions to set up either are in the description below.